Well, the important thing about stratified medicine is that it is a relatively new field, so we, we, we really have to train people to be able to use the skills and, and the ideas that form part of stratified medicine to make it an optimum treatment for, for individuals. So what we're finding here is, is new and different ways of thinking about delivering medicines to patients. So it's about making sure that when we actually treat someone, we treat them to the best of our ability. And it's about individualising the medicines that we give to people. There is a demand for this because it's relatively new. So we need to understand how to use stratified medicine, individualised or personalised medicine properly. So we need to make sure that you know, we treat the right patient with the right drug at the right time. And we don't treat people who um, will not respond to the drug. So it's a new and exciting area and something that we have to ensure that we move forward with quickly. And this programme will provide that information for our students. So there is a real demand to change the way in which medicines are delivered. And that is what this programme, this master's programme, is designed to do. Actually teach people how to deliver these medicines in a better and more organised manner. The University of Aberdeen has a long history of delivering master's, master's programmes and so you know, we've learned different ways of providing that education. So we teach the students with presentations, we have flipped classrooms where we have the students, they have directed learning and then come back and teach each other. Um, we also do practical work and probably the most exciting part of the master's programme is the research project which occurs towards the end about a 10 to 12 week project whereby the students get the opportunity to work with industry and we have something like um, the top 10 spin-out companies here in Aberdeen from the university and we, we try to get our students placed in each of these companies and that so far has been working very well both for the company and for the students involved. Anybody with a degree in biomedical science of, of any kind would be appropriate for stratified medicine because we do cover all the basic areas of therapeutics, pharmacology, pharmacokinetics, toxicology, regulatory affairs. We, we, we cover most of the areas within this programme. The career opportunities are big. So there is obviously the natural career in medicine, for example, if, if people are medically qualified. Um, there's then the career in academia, whereby you could go from the bench through a PhD, through a postdoc, to being a, a principal investigator and, and perhaps an academic. There's the industrial route where you do research and, and you, know, you may go on to head up some big pharma or biotech company. And thirdly, there's the kind of route through the regulatory agencies whereby people with the background in stratified medicine would understand the problems that are facing us in protecting human health and protecting the environment. Career opportunities are definitely global because all big pharma is global nowadays and the, the, the main industry is global and academia is global as, as it always has been. In terms of small to medium enterprises, then they too are um, not so much local but UK based um, and, and generally European based so that there, there are huge opportunities for um, individuals with this degree.